All right, everybody, we're here for the Shark Liftaway Steam Mop. Uh, first thing I want to talk about is the plug. It's not very long, so I have an attached here an extension cord. Um, I have an extension cord, so that's cool. But if you don't have one, something to think about. Otherwise, you're constantly plugging it in, unplugging it. And uh, before we get back to that, this is how easy it is to install the mop. Head. It is a no-touch system, so you just slide it over like this, let gravity take effect, press it down, and you're good to go. So now, back to the uh, extension cord thing. Every time that you plug it in, it will automatically turn on. There's no on button on the actual machine. It just will start steaming. It's, it's a weird feeling for an electron. I don't, I just, I don't necessarily like that. Um, so you can hear the steam going. I'm going to set it to high. Uh, so if you don't have an extension cord, you could potentially be waiting for it to steam back up every time you switch rooms, which is kind of annoying. It gets going pretty fast, relatively speaking, 30 seconds. But still, kind of annoying. Uh, you can see the, uh, the head of the mop is quite dirty. You throw it in the, the laundry machine every single time. It's cool to do that. Uh, so it's clean. It just doesn't necessarily look clean, um, but it's sanitized every single time. So it looks like after maybe four or five uses here, we are going to eventually need to buy new mop heads. Um, so that's fine. This, this thing is an ugly looking thing. It looks like some sort of alien broom. Uh, and they did that because they want you to be able to unplug this part from the, the whole Stick here and have it a handhold here. I don't really like the handhold feature in it. Um, I feel like it, the uh, scrubbing of the floor is much more applicable for this, but it's an option if you want to try that. Uh, in the videos, it shows people getting really big stains out. I don't use it for all, I just use it to go over my floors. I don't know if it's actually working or not. Uh, one of the, the things that I've worked this for is because. They say that steam is like a natural disinfectant, but the heat of the steam will kill germs. So hopefully that's doing something. I don't have any signs to back that up, but I can tell you this when I am finished with my floors. They are squeaky clean and it feels really nice. Um, every once in a while I'll go over the floors with some sort of disinfectant, like a like a swiftly wet jet or something like that, just to know that I have some sort of actual disinfectant on the floors. But like I said, this is supposed to be doing that, but there's just no way to really tell. Uh, so yeah, I, I get through the whole house without unplugging it if I have my extension cord. If I don't have my extension cord, it's going to take multiple times of unplugging, probably about every single room, which is annoying. So it's something to think about when you uh, are purchasing this. So you're going to have to maybe think about getting an extension cord, and you're also going to have to maybe think about getting uh, multiple heads, mop heads here. Um, so yeah, for this, this feature right here, just pushing it on the floor, it dries very quick, it feels great afterwards, it feels nice and clean, um, and it's pretty affordable. I get through the whole house, one floor, uh, three bedrooms, and uh, without having to refill the tent, so that's pretty cool. So yeah, I'm overall pretty satisfied with this. Um, we'll make it work. And I don't really use it for the handheld feature. Um, I tried it once, uh, just not for me. But if you just need something to clean the floors, uh, give this one a try. Have a tank.
I hope everything's here. Clearly this stuff has been opened before. Things are not in the packaging. And I guess we'll see.